model display tools using the zoom tools we're going to have to create uh, a building model and to do so we're going to have to navigate around to see it uh, so one of the tools we're going to use is our zoom tools and we have a variety of those we're going to go over on the right side of the screen and in the on the bar over here this is called the navigation bar and we have the bottom button is all our zoom tools first one we're going to use is a zoom in region so if we make sure that's active we want to click right on the little magnifying glass in the green button click on that button and you'll get a magnifying glass now I'm going to zoom into this bathroom I drag a window and I can now zoom into that bathroom if I want to zoom again go over and click on the green uh, part of this icon and I can zoom right in onto the bathroom now if I want to go over and hit the down arrow I can zoom out and it'll go out two levels of zoom I can go out and zoom out again and it keeps zooming out if I want to zoom to fit zoom to fit will force everything to fit on the screen so no matter how far I zoom in on something I'll zoom in on this bed over here I can always come back and zoom the fit and it will force everything to draw on the screen. Likewise, we have zoom all the fit. Uh, now zoom all the fit is essentially is going to put everything uh, that's in your window there. So I'll say zoom all the fit and it's very similar to zoom fit except that it'll have anything in our, in the view will be uh, forced to fit into our screen. So I'll go here and I'll go uh, zoom all the fit and it'll, it'll anywhere that we have drawn and they'll force it. If I say zoom the fit it'll force it to the objects to fill the screen. So also zoom sheet size. If I'm down in my project browser and I have a sheet going on uh, active and I'll come down in my sheets I'll go into my second floor plan and I can let's say I zoomed in on some area such as my title block and now I'm ready to see the whole title block I would zoom sheet size alright so I'll go out zoom sheet size and it'll allow me to zoom out to the, to the largest uh, thing on my sheet. I'll do that one more time. I'll zoom sheet size and it'll force it to fill the screen. So to recap, I'll go in on the first floor plan. The one you're going to use most is zoom in region. It's much like a zoom window in AutoCAD and you're also going to use the, the zoom to fit and that will actually force everything on the screen. Those are the two that you'll use most.